The colour, the passion, the derby. There is nothing quite like it. Two teams forever linked by history. But what does the immediate future have in store for them? It's coming up live. So many wonderful things to do here in Istanbul and football watching is amongst them. Welcome to the home of Galatasaray. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Galatasaray, and they take on Fenerbahce. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And the starting 11 for Galatasaray. Fernando Muslera is the goalkeeper. Hakim Ziyech plays with Wilfred Zaha out wide. And playing up front today, Mauro Icardi. Lovely tempo to this passing sequence. Dusan Tadic. Fred. Nicely timed tackle. And here's the Fenerbahce lineup. Well, it's a 4 5 1, but with three of the midfield players giving close support to the centre forward, and the other two sitting deeper. Also, watch out for the fullbacks getting forward at every opportunity. They do like to get crosses into the box. Angles it back. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Kadioglu. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, there's defensive solidity for you. Wilfried Zaha. Sebastian Szymanowski. Dusan Tadic. Difficult to stop him. They could nudge in front. Terrific piece of anticipation. Can someone get on the end of this? Struggling to get it away. Fred. A good and fair challenge. Ziyech. Lucas Torreira now. Well, strong play here. Oh, but they've lost it now. Ziku. Well, Fenerbahce sloppy in possession. The first half here comes to an end. Well, he's got a few things right in this first half, but not everything. Well, I've been disappointed with him in that first half. He just didn't have an impact on the game. Yes, the service into him wasn't great, but his movement needs to be a lot better. Let's hope he improves in the second half. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Davinson Sanchez. Abdul Kerim Badakchi. 
Japan, Aihan. Moving the ball really well here. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes, finally. Irfan Chan Kavechi. And showing the importance of wind. Fred. Can he take advantage? Still looking for space. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. And a good take under duress there. And a free kick awarded by the referee. And they're making a change. And nicely over the top. And clears the danger. And taken away. He won the ball. Now Icardi involved in the attack. Will there be any production? Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Tadic. Under a stupid piece of defending. Akhtur Kolu. And now with Angelino. Well, a swift challenge and a throw in coming up. So making the substitution now. Angelino They're on the scent of a winner late in this game Dzeko It was a menacing attack but tidied up Well the fans are making so much noise here They believe the winner's coming but it needs a moment of inspiration for one of those players out on the pitch. What a finale we've got. And just five minutes remaining. Angelino. He's thrusting through the gears, Dries Mertens. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Kent. Ryan Kent. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.